How's it going guys, my name is AJ, and today I'm here to give you guys my worst skins in Smash 4. I did my best skins, you guys seem to like it in quotes, some of you hated me for my opinions, but it's only going to get worse in this video, so if you guys are ready to get triggered, let's get started. The worst skin for Mario is easily this green and brown looking one, that is it's just really disgusting. I honestly wouldn't really say Luigi has a worse skin, Luigi's one of those characters where it's like all the skins are pretty good, but I would have to say this one's the worst one. It's kind of pink and weird looking. It's not a bad skin, but it's the worst one out of the ones he has. They're all really good. I'd use any of them. I said this in my last video, but Peach's worst skin is the Daisy skin. It, the, the brown and the yellow, the kind of yellowish brown and the yellow just don't work at all. I would have to say it's kind of a tie between the two worst Bowser skins. It's either this one or this one. I think it's this one. I don't know. Again, it's just kind of that yellowy brown that just is disgustingly bad. Yoshi skins are all just colors, so, I mean, I guess it depends on your least favorite color. But, I mean, if I had to pick, it's probably the pink one. It's just not a good shade of pink. Like, they, maybe if it was a brighter pink, it'd be better. But, it's, again, it's kind of fleshy and bad. I'd have to say the worst Rosalina skin is probably either the green or the gold. Probably the gold. I don't know. Rosalina doesn't really have that many bad skins either, but I'd have to say this was the worst out of all of them. Prepare to get triggered. I don't know why so many of you guys like this skin, but Ludwig is the worst skin for Bowser Jr. with Wendy at a very, very close second. Ludwig is just... I, 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 I hate it. I mean, look at the hair is dumb. The tooth is stupid looking. It's... Eh. I don't, I, don't, I don't know why you like it so much. I don't know why so many people... So many people get so mad when you say you hate the skin, but it's not good. I don't like it. Wario, again, just kind of has colors. Nothing, like, insanely different about his palettes. But, I mean, I guess I'd have to say this one by default. Again, because it's the same thing as the Mario one. Green and brown, not good. DK is, yet again, just colors, but eh, the gold does not work. <laughs> Diddy Kong, I'd have to say it's this one, just because of the color of the fur. I don't know. Diddy Kong has some pretty good skins, but this one's the worst. I'd have to say this is the worst Game & Watch skin. Like, it, I don't know why so many of these colors... I don't know why Nintendo just chose this nasty green color for a lot of their skins. It's not good. Little Mac doesn't really have any bad skins either, but I have to say this one's the worst. Again, again with the fudging yellow. Look at that hair. What is? Why do they keep doing this? This yellowy brown. Any other color would have worked. I would have to say the worst Link skin. As much as I hate to say it, it's this one. You, you guys know from the last video that I like the, the the black and white skins. They're not necessarily my favorite skins, but I just think they're the skins that look the cleanest. I might use a different skin for a character, but the black and white ones are usually my favorites because they're the cleanest looking. Black and white are just simple colors. They always look good on most of the characters like Yoshi and Zelda, but uh, I, it just, I don't think it works for this Link skin. I, there's something about the, uh, the eyes and I don't know. It just doesn't work. It's especially not as well as the other ones. Other Link skins. The worst Zelda skin is probably this one, I'd have to say. Yeah, this is the worst Zelda skin right here. I don't, I don't know what's with that hair. It's not a good look. Worst Meta Knight for me is probably the pink. I don't know. Again, Meta Knight doesn't really have any bad skins. This one's just the worst out of all of them. The lesser of evil, so to speak, this is the pink one. DDD's worst skin, it's kind of debatable. Again, not really any bad skins, but I'd have to go with this one. There's just something about the, uh... It's, it's like black and white, like retro movie, but it's... Not a good color. Like, I, I, I kind of see what they're going for, and that's what they were going for, but it, it just looks disgusting, kind of, despite that. This is how it should have been done, the DDD skin. But that's not my least favorite Kirby. My least favorite Kirby skin is probably this one. The lime green. Uh, again, lesser evils, I guess. All Kirby skins are good. If I had to pick a Duck Hunt skin to be the worst, yet again, lesser of evils, I'd have to say it's this one. I don't know, it's kind of it's kind of plain compared to all the other ones. Just the brown. And the duck doesn't look that cool. The donation's cool because the duck looks cool. This skin's cool because it looks black and white. Of course, the duck looks cool, but this one just doesn't really have anything cool about it. The, the brown one. Robin. Uh, Robin's worst skin is any male skin. It's just how it works. Ike's worst skin is the brown. Again, they're using that yellowy brown that I just don't like. It's not a good color. Why do they keep using it? I don't get it. I never noticed this until now. Here we go again. The, the, I never noticed how many characters have this yellowy brown color to them but it's not good why do they keep using it they could have gone with like purple like a purple and black marsh skin would have looked awesome i don't know palutena 
it's hard to tell. I'd have to say this one probably, just based on the picture here. I, I've really only used Palutena as one skin. I never really even see what this looks like outside of the game, outside of this uh, CSP, but this is probably the worst just by looking at it. Here, here we go again with the fudge and gold yellow. I don't get it. It's not good. Why do they keep using it? Eh, the worst DSS skin is the lime green. Not like again, it's another one of those lesser a few evils examples. This skin's not terrible. It's not good, but it's not terrible. And it's their worst skin, but it's not terrible. It's not like um, green and brown Mario or Ludwig to levels of bad. Worst Samus skin is probably this one. I just don't think the colors work well together. Just, is that like is it like an orange or a red around the helmet and around the chest plate and then I don't think it works well with the green it just doesn't work well together I don't really like that orange color either it's not a good color this Toon Link skin is kind of the same example as the little Mac I mean as the uh, Link skin kind of the exact same reasons just as this skin it's not a bad skin I actually like it but it, it, I think it's I think it's just the worst looking it's the skin that I would use the skin the only skin that I wouldn't use out of all of these out of all the Toon Link skins. Again, I don't, I don't play Ganondorf. Ganondorf skins don't really look that different except for some recolors. Just, just for the, just because we're on the topic of triggering people, oh, Ganondorf is the worst. Here we go again. Why does every character have this disgusting yellowy brown? This is Sheik's worst skin. Sheik has a lot of really good skins, you know, the red, the green, but this one, it, this one, it kind of works on Sheik because it kind of matches Sheik's hair color. The Sheik's hair color hasn't really changed that much, so it's not like it's a bad shade for her because it's what always it's always on her. But this one is not as bad as like this. It's not this color doesn't look as bad on Sheik as it does for the previous characters, but it's still not a good color. I don't know why they keep using it. Fox doesn't have any bad skins either. If I had to pick up the worst Fox skin, probably this one right here. Yeah, again, lesser of evils. This is my least favorite skin out of all of them that I've seen. Fox has some really good skins, but this is my least favorite. Falco is kind of the same thing as Fox. And the worst one, worst in quotes, is this one because it looks too much like the original. Why would you even use this over the original skin? Like, look at this. You even see a difference? I mean, there's a difference, obviously, but it's not that prevalent. So, yeah. I mean, if you're going to use a blue skin, I'd use this one. If you like blue. Pikachu is kind of weird because I think my least favorite skin is also my favorite skin, which is the Choice Band one. The Choice Band one was the one that I used when I played Pikachu a whole lot, but then I realized how bad the orange was. But like, this, this is the best skin in theory because the Choice Band is so cool. The fact that they took an actual, the, the fact that one of the skins is an actual item from Pokemon that they use in competitive play to make the Pokemon stronger is on this skin, but if it wasn't orange, I'd, e I'd easily be using it. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know why they made it this I guess there's not really anything you can do with the palettes for Pikachu. Like, you can only make it, make his skin so many different colors. But yeah, I don't know why they made it the disgusting orange. Worst Charizard skin is probably the skin Introspective uses. I don't know. It's, it, again, it's kind of like, who was that character before? There's some character before that this color just did not work on. And I don't think it works on Charizard either. Uh, yeah. All the, all the other Charizard skins are really good. This is the only one I would not use if I was playing Charizard. But I'm pretty sure that's why Introspective said he uses this one, so good on you, friend. Worst Lucario skin is probably, a, I think it's, it's either this one or this one. I like purple. Purple's one of my favorite colors. And this skin is fudging clean. But they just kind of mix this purple. Which one is it? This one. With that red. I don't know. I think this is the worst one. It's not, it's not bad. But it's not like the best skin. Lucario's got some top tier skins. Like this one. And the purple one. And then they got this one, which is just not as good as the others. Julie Buff is hard to say because they're all adorable. If I had to pick my least favorite, it's it's really hard. I'd have to say, I'd have to say the leaf green hat. It makes Julie Puff an, upon further inspection, it makes Julie Puff a not good shade of pink. That doesn't look that good, but you know, lesser of evils again. This is easily the worst green skin. I don't know why the skin's in the game. It's way too fleshy pink. Disgusting. Gross. Yeah, worst Rob skin? Probably this one. Rob skins are all good. This is just the worst. Ness has some baller skins. Uh, if I, had to, I can't pick a worst. I can't pick the worst Ness skin. It's too hard. Mm, just throwing this out there. I mean, is this hard to pick? 
because Nessa's skins are so good. I'd say this one. This is my least favorite, I guess. I don't know, it's hard. <laughs> Again, prepare to be tr fudging triggered. Trigger warning right across the screen. I'm not gonna put it in there, but Gold Falcon, disgusting color. You should feel bad if you use this skin. End the story. Get triggered. Worst villager skin is probably this one. There's just something about the hair and the eyes. Like, why are the eyebrows like that? Why are the, what are those, eyelashes? I don't even know what those are. They look like bags under her eyes. This is probably the worst one. Olimar doesn't have any bad colors either because they're so simple. If I had to pick a worse one, it's Pink Alf. Alf's my favorite of the two. This is the skin I would use if I played Olimar. But, uh, I wouldn't use Pink Alf. I can't really pick a skin for Wii Fit Trainer either because I like red, blue, and green, and yellow. But I guess, oh wait, yes I can, any of the male skins. If you use the male Wii Fit Trainer skins, you're right, you're, you're wrong, you're objectively wrong. That's how it works. Don't use the male skins. Shulk doesn't have any bad skins either. I want to say this one for the memory. I don't like it that much. I wouldn't use this one, but it's not bad. Uh, probably the pink. I think, I think the pink is the only one of these colors I wouldn't use. Dr. Mario, I wouldn't use this one. Again, that, that pink color, that fleshy pink. I just I just don't like this color, and I wouldn't use this. It's bad. I'd have to say the worst Dark Pit skin is probably this one. Because it's got that, um, that dark yellow golden color. That's not good. Again, by default, I have to say it's this one. And you guys are all going to fudge and comment. They're like, oh, energy, all the skins you pick for the worst skins are the same. They're all the dark yellow one. Well, you know what? Fudge you. I do what I want. Easily the worst Lucina skin is this one. It's just... Oh, wait, no, actually, it's a tie between this one and this one. This one's got too many colors going on. There's red. There's white. There's the fleshy pink. There's the green hair. There's way too much. It'd be fine if it was just red and green and white. I mean, it'd be Christmassy. It'd be fun. But the fleshy pink just... Kind of destroys, ruins the whole thing. And this one again, too many colors. You got purple, you got dark green. I see some of that fleshy pink in there. You got still the green and the in the what's it called armor, I guess. And then you got the blue cape. Color it's just too many colors and they don't mesh well together. Prepare to get triggered yet again. Another another skin that you guys said was the best one. I disagree with. This is the worst Pac-Man skin. Pac mitts, not good. I would never use it. It just does not look good. Mega Man has a plethora of terrible skins. I can't even like, it sucks that my main has like the, the most bad skins. Like three of his skins are completely unplayable. This skin is unplayable. Like it's like a, it's like a yellow, green, and red. You guys know I'm all about the yellow, but when you mix it with that green and that red, it just does not look good. This skin is okay, but it's still not playable for me. The, mixing the yellow with that green just makes it look kind of nasty. This skin is playable though. It's not bad, but it's not good. And then this skin. This skin is that ugly brown mixed with yellow again, and it's just not good. Mega Man has like some terrible alts. <laughs> like, he's got some of the worst colors in the game, and he's got the most. Like I don't think there's many characters in this game that have three out of eight bad skins that are just completely unplayable. That's from the top of my head. If you guys know any that I might be forgetting, let me know. Sonic doesn't have any bad skins either. Uh, if I again, I just have to pick a worst one. Probably the, either the orange or the green. They both look really good still. I'd use either one of these if I had to. Like if I was forced to use one of these skins or default, I would use one of these skins. But uh, I don't know. The gold looks good. The black looks good. The white looks good. This one is looks good too. This I like purple so. And then, then these are the ones you're left with, so. This is probably the worst Mewtwo skin. And I, again, worst in quotes. It's not bad. Not It's just not good. I don't hate it. It's not a bad skin. Worst Lucas skin, I'd have to say, is this one. This is probably the only Lucas skin I wouldn't use. I'd use this one. I'd use this one. I have used this one in the past. I use this one now for Taheda. I like this one. I like this one because of the dog. And I like this one because the purple and green work well together. But uh, this one is just the only one that I wouldn't use out of all of them. Roy's worst skin is probably this one. I don't know. Just the dark purple with the... I like purple. You guys know. But the light purple with the dark purple just does... No, no. Change your mind. Change your mind. Take that back. I didn't see the skin. Ugly dark gold. Or ugly dark yellow gold. Disgusting. Get it out of here. Didn't see this one until just now. This purple skin is light years better than this one. Gross. The worst reuse skin... Probably... Which one was it? This one. It's... 
it's a lesser evil than the fleshy pinks we've been seeing before. It's uh, it's a lot better of a shade. That's cl it's close to that, but it's a lot better shade. But uh, you know, I I cannot use I use this for your skin. I use this for your skin. I use this one. I use this one. I use this one. I use this one. I love this one. This is great for your skin. But this is the only one I want to use. Cloud skins, you can't really tell the difference again because all cloud skins looks the same except for the there's there's two different variants where they look the same i honestly can't even pick a worse skin because they all look exactly the same i, I literally can't <laughs> like they're not bad but they're not different they just all they all feel like the same one this is the only one that looks any different i don't know I, i'm i'm speechless on this one and of course yet again corn don't pick the mail as long as you don't pick the mail you got a good skin on your hands don't pick the mail, please. I beg of you. Be the person that I expect you to be. Be the person that's a ray of sunshine and humanity instead of being the scum of the earth. Pick the pick the female version. Do yourself a favor. And then lastly, again, I don't have Bayonetta. I'm not going to buy Bayonetta. To elaborate on that, Tail should have been in Smash in the game of Fudging Me costume instead, which is why I refused to buy her. And I feel like she doesn't fit. Nothing to do with her character as a whole. Or how she plays, or how fun she is. I just refuse. I just, out of personal spite, same reason I won't play Ganondorf. I'm not buying Bayonetta. But Bayonetta, Bayonetta One, any Bayonetta One skin, worse skin. If you're using Bayonetta One, it's the inferior skins. Bayonetta Two is the only, the only plausible Bayonetta skin is Bayonetta Two. 